All right, so I'm down here with Snow Badger, and I'm trying to figure out the wiring for the painless system and the uh, Holly system. And I forgot to tell you guys something that's new to the channel. But before we get to that, let's go ahead and get the uh, wiring done on this so we can do so. All right, let's go. Like that hurt. Oh, I got them fucking tools all over the place. Pick all these up. Let's get to the video. All right, everybody, welcome back. So I know I said I was going to do that harness in there, but I want the car started. So I'm going to go ahead and just do this painless system that I bought. I'm going to put that in there. Then also have the new fitting that I needed for the oil feed that's underneath there. So let's quit talking. Let's get this stuff together. And I want to get this car started. But first things first, I'm going to go ahead and put this uh, cooler system, trans cooler system in. I'm going to get that mounted up, bolt that up to the Turbo 400, and then we'll start finishing the wiring. Let's go. All right, so I got the trans cooler lines mounted. Those coming over there, up, having to go up and over. And then I'm having them come through the underside there. One's getting connected there. I just mounted it. And I had to use that barb on the other side because I'm an idiot and broke this. My OCD wanted both the flat parts here to be together. And I went too far and snapped it. But the trans cooler is in. It's only in temporarily because I have self tappers in, which still kind of held this thing in pretty good. But I'm going to get quarter 20 bolts, run that all the way through to the inside. But that's on there. The lines are on, I made that extra long. So then I'm going to order the new Dash 4 with the 90 so I can go into there. But right now, this is on here so I can get fluid in the transmission here so we can turn this car on. So, let's start wiring. All right. Well, I got the exhaust on. As you saw here, how long it is, I cut it down. So, it's just going to be right above. I got heat wrapped. I'm going to wrap this whole thing in. So, I'm going to wrap the whole exhaust. I got my things to put the heat wraps over that. So we'll be good to go with it. Oh, but it, it looks pretty good. Yeah, over here's the other half. Just cut it right off there. Because with this, what's actually supposed to do the full thing is it actually turns the other way and it goes back down into there. Well, I didn't want to do that. I got too much stuff. This is easier to cut it, go flush right up. So there's the exhaust done. I'll put the bong or the O2 sensor down there. But first off, let me get this thing wrapped. So then we can get this on here and start the car. All right, everybody. So I have the uh, exhaust done. I put the heat wrap on the returns going down. Put all the injectors on the inside here. And then on the inside, these are all the wires I'm not using, but I got the painless system here that's plugged in. And I just have the necessary ones that are going, especially here in the back, everything's connected. This is just to test it. Like these negatives together, I'm eventually going to be taking the end of this and then putting it right to the frame. But that's not going to be the main solution. Um, I am going to be doing it the right way. And then I still have these two for the ECU. That's going to go right to the battery. The switch is in. And then coming on to this side, I have... The grounds all lined up. Ground down there. The, this one is 
to turn on to send power to it. This is the red on for the ECU. And then this one goes to the line filter or line, I don't know how to say it. The line filter, the go from the 24 or from the 20 or 58 tooth down to the 24 of what the ECU is. So I have all these connected. It's getting late. I got work tomorrow, so I still have to do laundry and get ready for that. Also, I got the power cable from the battery to the starter and then also the yellow one to the fuel pump man i almost forgot as i sit here and edit the video i forgot to tell you guys that down below we unlock together the join option where we can uh all come together and i can send you guys behind the scenes stuff uh post videos before they even come out we can do super chat super likes uh, all that stuff. If that's something that you guys want to see, um, I'll activate it and then we can all join as a community for it. So go ahead and like this video if you want me to do that. If we can get 10 likes on the video, I'll go ahead and do it. If I don't get 10 likes, then I'm not even going to worry about it. Just go ahead and subscribe. And if you can, share because all of us as a collective on this channel... We are only 29 subscribers away to 1,000 subscribers. And I want us to keep growing so that we can make more content. Hit subscribe. And then I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.